We're on the X's from the Z's. And there's only one X. His name is Zool. He's a necromancer. He was super popular when he came out. And then a whole bunch of stuff got nerfed. And he's seen some different changes through the year or two. He's been out. I'm not sure how long he's been out. Uh, he's a specialist. He pushes waves. His abilities... Uh, his trait is Ray Skeleton. Uh, when a minion dies, boop, there's a skeleton. And then suddenly your wave is twice as big. Super cool. His Q is pretty simple. It's just a skill shot that takes a minute, but it travels out from the location that you put it down backwards to you. And Cursed Strikes is an attack speed steroid uh, and uh, cleave. So it turns your... Your auto attacks quicker and it makes him swing in a pretty big arc that also slows other people's attack speed super useful bone prison is uh, arguably the best part about his kit it is a root that you can put on whoever you want and then after two seconds it just pops up and holds them still for quite a long time it's pretty cool uh, his ultra poison open skeletal mages everybody likes skeletal mages I can see why, maybe for the zone control, and you know, it, it could be helpful. But I love Poison Nova because fucking damage. Just, just damage. Huh. And uh, the other thing they don't tell you about this is this ability. He has a, he has a one key that gives him a shield. Uh, I believe it's on a 30 second cooldown. And it's super useful. Um, so we'll, we'll see. He's, he's in a weird spot right now. Uh, he's not great, but he's definitely not terrible, especially in quick match. So let's see how it goes. Oh, yeah. Hmm. This has been a trying experience. Very, very trying indeed. I did, however, have a lot of success with this talent. So we are going to take Backlash for our bone armor, which, in case you didn't see... Takes 12% of their maximum Five, health if they are four, standing next to three, me. Two, one. And that is if they blow the shield up or if it expires. So, that's pretty fucking good. And we have the ability to make them sit still and sit right on next to us. Gonna just keep you right there. Gonna walk towards you with their shield. Ooh, almost got him. Um, help, help. We're gonna walk this way. Probably not good. Uh, nope, yep, that was the bad decision. Because my healer kept walking this way. Hmm. And this guy went up here. You know, this isn't making it level one, is not. Not my strongest suit. Oh, I like this. Up to me. Okay, so we're just gonna try and pitch Q's, and use W's, and occasionally E people. Did you see? It did some damage. Just gonna slow your attack speed down there a little bit, buddy, with our W. And I get some of those heals. And then we're just gonna sit back because we can passively hold the wave off just ever so slightly. And these guys, if they want to be all hyper aggressive like they are being, let them. Because I don't care. I could sit right here all day. Just gonna use this. Oh, I didn't just. Popped it off of me and slowed me, and I hate him. Probably should have got it closer. Blinging cues. Look at all them skeletons. Look at all them skeletons. I'm gonna go get some mana because I don't yet have the talent that will help me with my mana sustain. Once we hit level, what is it, seven? Yes, seven. We'll get the ability to hang out in the lane. Um. Yeah, that's fine. 
sight of the sun. Uh, that maybe not. Soon they shall die. Stay on this in case he does warp. He did warp. Not him. Wow. Thanks, game. We're gonna take jailers because jailers helps our skeletons attack enemies. Got him. And after the quest is complete, at 80%, our skeletons get more attack speed and damage. Movement speed and attack speed. Which is super useful for hitting people. Did you see that? I should have walked up. Definitely should have walked up. I need healing assistance. Hmm. Why are there four people in the middle lane? Why is no... What? What is happening? I don't understand. What are you doing? There is more to do. What? I'm doing the most hero damage. Yeah, that's not good. That's really bad, actually. It's really horribly bad. Ooh. We're gonna actually click it. Yeah, there we go. Please stop chasing my team. And then try ghouls at them. How much is left on that? Can't be much. Oh my god, it's half the bar. We're doing real well. I could have killed him too. That was totally my bad. I want to keep going in, I really do. Stop chasing my fucking healer. Thank you, healer. As the balance We're just gonna keep throwing sights. Please stop everything that you are doing. It's magic, but she seems to be shooting you with some form of technology. Ah! Ah! Have a shield. It worked. Exquisitely done. Oh dear, I'm out of mana. All right, let's go back to the base. Why isn't anybody soaking middle? Do the experience of gains. I'm gonna miss a huge chunk of this wave. Possibly the whole thing. At least two thirds. Please stop. That gonna work? Suck skeleton! And Abathur. Yeah! Good job, team! You are the greatest, Abathur. We're just gonna keep this lane pushed, because whatever they are doing, they are not here. Probably. I don't know what they're doing, actually. They're probably soaking. We're gonna take Poison Nova, because I think this is gonna be another executioner game, because we deal insane amounts of damage. Gotcha. Got you too. We're gonna put that. Get some more skeletons. That is our quest completed. Will you? Oh! Damn it. 
But we got him. He's on my head. I have a shield. You're dead. <laughs> oh god, I'm dead. Oh, I don't have any mana to stop him now. Hey, and he grabbed a minion anyway, so it doesn't matter. Look at that back animation. What a dancer. Oh, team's bringing it back. We weren't doing some things in the beginning. Oh, look at this! He's gonna help me push! Honestly, this build is a little bit more conducive to team fighting. Um, even though I should be pushing at all times with this character. Let's go help do this. This build does put out some pretty bruisery damage. Twelve percent of your maximum health, man. Like, are you, what? I tried. See if we can't go get that Genji. Hurt. You coming? Yeah. putting out the damage there's the executioner now every time that we hit somebody who is rooted or slowed gotta wait should have waited for the teleport um they are going to take some uh, super damage and if we have our w on at the time it's going to do that damage cleavely it's going to cleave that damage and in an arcs that's what cleave means yeah you better warp every time Um. Are we gonna get him? Are we gonna get him? Look at that! Look at all that damage! Look at it, it's so good! But he got away. You're now you're dead! Bye! That good Oh, here he comes. Here comes the old quick match. Uh, you're going to take that. I don't think you're going to take that, actually. Yes. My magic flows through the temples. Guardians. Okay, it's fine. Not let these Even though they're probably going to come kill you. They're doing the boss. They're not doing a boss? What the fuck are they doing? Port, destroy. Let's get this motherfucker! Oh, was I standing in front of that? That's my bad. I was trying hard not to, too. Damn it! Sight, skeletons, Spectre, Death. Have we been talking about these? You I think I have. I'm pretty sure I have. I it's the Executioner. Yeah. Deal in hyper damage. Especially when they are rooted, which means once we hit 16, they're gonna take extreme now hyper damage. Oh, look at how dead all these guys are. Ah. Gonna clean. Does he understand his role? Amplify damage. Okay, yeah, I'm cool with that. Let's do it. I've got these guys. And now our damage is incredible. Oh god. Maybe I should have put them further down here. Because they did do a lot of damage. But um, he killed them. He killed at least two of them. I find 
I'm sitting. Um, they're probably all backing oh, right now. Dead. I'm still gonna kill as much of this wave and skeletonize it as possible. Avatar's getting his awesome ass stacks off of it too for I'll his monstrosity. I never condone monstrosity, but, you know. It seems to be working this game. The enemy team can't deal with our split push pressure because they have uh, zero wave clear outside of this little bugger. And he's only got like what I call moderate wave clear. I'm gonna go bottom. I didn't realize that Nubarak went top. I wanted to push that. Okay, it's fine. They're still clearing out the boss. That's easily gonna get a keep. Which is extremely good for our team. Fuck yes, team. And just wait right here. There he is. Got him. Block my ships. Uh, I'm silenced. We're gonna put these here. I'm dead. But my guys are doing stuff. Their <laughs> tank was top. <laughs> Um. Uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> the Beetleborg and the Slugman got pretty, pretty decent trait value out of that. And he still got his monstrosity doing monster things. They're not going to get anything because they don't have power to push to get anything. Um, yeah. There is more to do, it seems. We're going to go down bottom and just make sure the wave stays up. Because these catapults the don't need to do everything begins. by themselves. No idea this, as he knows you. Attack! 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 Alright, we're good. In case you didn't know, Tragul is the giant dragon that presides over Sanctuary. I found him! I'm silenced. Got him! What are you pinging me for? Hey! Got him! Did you see the damage? Did you see it? We're gonna take Kaelin's Edict because every time that we summon a skeletal warrior, it decreases our cooldown by, is it one? One percent. Which is pretty good. Pretty fucking good. Ooh, that D shield. That is super early D shield. <laughs> Don't sleep on the Zool damage. How much are we putting out? We are keeping up. We're doing more than everybody on the enemy team, and that is fucking impressive considering what they have. I love this build. <laughs> All right, now. Do not fear. We don't have any way to raise skeletons here, which is a little, little much, little much bummer. English is my native language. So we're gonna lose some sustain without our skeletons, but that's um, potentially okay. We're gonna lock him in. Look at, look at that! Look at that! No, why are you walking that way? You can do it. He's right there. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. That's how you do it. Good job with them snipers. We're gonna go this way. Lock him down. Fucking righteous team. Let's take the let's take the core. Let's take the core. We're all up. They're not. Let's do this. We're just gonna get some skeleton assistance real quick. We're gonna root him. More skeleton assistance. 
Damage. There it is. GG team. Yeah! It's good stuff. Good stuff. I had some complaints, but they were ultimately for naught. Because this guy. This guy knows what he's fucking doing. Yeah, you voted that slug. You fucking do it. Anyway, that <laughs> look at that. I got him. Somebody voted for me. Huh? Huh? Okay. So that was Zool. Are you fucking joking? I just like just give me this stupid loot chest. I just need. I just need a loot. I just need a loot chest, man. I just. I gotta get my fix. Just give me the fucking. Just, you're ten cents short. Anyway. Uh, four nine four. That's that's okay. Avatar killed us in the siege damage. Holy fuck! Everybody killed us in the siege damage. Huh. Well, I kept up in hero damage though, didn't I? Beat everybody. Avatar beat everybody in fucking everything though, so I guess that wasn't. Um, it's not too shabby. That was good. That was good. Uh, here is the talent build. Uh, backlash for 12% of the max health of the enemy, which is fucking ridiculous. Uh, let's see, and then there was Jailers. You get two Skeletal Warriors. They fixate on the enemy because your E is on them, and then if there's more Skeletal Warriors in the lane because you're fighting in the lane because you often fight in the lane, those guys will also hit your target, uh, and they have increased attack speed and movement speed. Awesome. There's Dracul's Essence, which is fucking rocking as well. Um, this is every time we summon a Skeletal Warrior, which is very, very, very often. Uh, skeletal Mages, because I wanted to go for the Executioner, even though Poison Nova by itself does insane amounts of damage. It's more of a Wombo ultimate. And this helps you proc this thing, because it slows. Uh, and it does hang around for a while. So you don't really want it for the damage, you want it more for the slow and the area control to help you with your executioner. Because this fucking hurts. And if you hit your W, it's automatically cleaving. It's fucking ridiculous. Uh, then there's amplified damage because you just want them to sit still and it's gonna make skeletons do more damage. You do more damage when you're already doing more damage. Fuck yeah. And then there's Kalen's Edict, which is going to reduce the cooldown of your ultimate per Skeletal Warrior attack. Oh my god, I thought it was Summon. All the more reason to have this. Holy fuck, that's insane. Didn't know that. Uh, yeah. So if they attack 100 times, you got your ult back. That's crazy, I had no idea. Um, do they, is it? I guess I'd have to test that. I don't know if it's attacks against heroes or just attacks, period. Because they attack a lot. And sometimes they're just attacking minions. Hmm. Hmm. By 1%. Anyway, that is Zool. These are his abilities, in case you needed them. But they're all pretty awesome. All nearby skeletal warriors will fixate on the target for their duration. <gasps> this guy's fucking rocking. I love the Diablo characters. This is our only X hero, so when we come back, it looks like I clicked it. We'll be on the V's, which are a might bit more fun. Varian, Vala, Valera. I like all three of these guys. Guy and girls. Probably more the girls than the guy. Hey, maybe a little. Anyway, I'll see you next time. Be sure to do all that YouTube stuff if you want to, or don't. It's your life. Nobody can tell you what to do.